good even <laughs> Thank you for subscribing, uh, Martinez Torres. Uh, <laughs> good evening, everyone. My name is Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Projute video. But before I get started, I'm going to announce the winners of the Koji uh, competition. Oh my gosh, what is going on here? Oh, I still have my. <laughs> uh, let's go to the filters. It's under the filters. There they are. There they are. Okay, so welcome back to another Roblox Projute um, video tutorial kind of thing. It's all new. Anyhow, 10 winners of 10 cards. And you can see that these are not scratched off. These are all fresh cards. Okay, so these these 10 are the ones that are, are the winners of the Koji contest. You won! All right? You, you are... You got the top games the top 10 games out of the there were 23 games total that were submitted um so congratulations and you are here so uh no particular order but uh the winners themselves are faraz 965 with code primate asteroids kinder with the snake kinder version Bel Air 08 with wood chopper Blaze Sword with, uh, sorry, Blaze Sword 2008 with Log Cutters. Erity in Plays with Lumber Tycoon Match Game. Uh, Todd Carnegie with Sling the Axe. Xeno Plays with Code Blast. Mini De Reaper with the Mini De Reaper game I tried. And Master YTPL with Code Primate Tetris Master. And the memer with Lumber Tower. Congratulations, you guys. These were the top ten games. These were the ones that we picked and we chose. And and don't think that it was just me going through and going, I like that one, I like that one. I actually put this to the test and I, I gave my uh, all the pro uh, the protégés and all the admins. I said, hey, you have ten hearts. Here's a list of all the games. Go through, play them. Put a heart on the one that you like, and once your ten hearts are done, we'll all come to a consensus of which ones we liked and, and everything else. So, huge thank you to everybody who participated. Now, if you have not contacted us, if you're on this list and you have not contacted us, or you don't have us uh, any way for us to contact you in the Discord, please do so. And um, if you contact us and we've never seen you before, we are going to make you verify it by going to your Koji game and putting in your name into the description of that game. <laughs> Excuse me, coffee. <clears throat> oh, it got dark. Oh, geez. Anyhow, one last congratulations. Thank you so much, and a big shout out to Koji for hooking that up. Um, I only have one left from the previous uh what, what was the giveaway what did we do with koji uh the top 10 scores of koji of the the game i only have one left uh and you are da, 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 da. never oh wait yeah never ends 23 so never ends 23 this is yours but you got to contact me because i've been sending you emails and I, I can't get a hold of you so never ends 23 please contact me Everybody else, I will get your cards, not out to you tonight, because I'm recording tonight, but I will get them to you um, as I verify each person, and I'll check you off the list and make sure that you get your monies. Oh my goodness. Now, let's get down to some business. Some business. Because inside this game, it's, it's amazing, it's fun, it's awesome, but it's a constant grind to try and build and make things. If you're not concentrating on money, you're not going to have money for... For your blueprints and everything else. Now you might look and see that I've got 2,596 over there. And you're like, oh cool, that's a really nice number to have. You should be very proud of that. I am very proud of that. But that was one run. One run, that's what I got. What? What? What did you run, Code? Stone. That's right, stone. This is it. Right here, slate. In my backpack right now, I have um, tools to build. I've got... Um, my axe, my saw, my pickaxe, and my chisel. That's it. 
Okay, now I could go and grind out some irons and melt them down and try and sell them off, but it's a process and it's a lot of chopping, a lot of stuff to do. So what I do is I do this. Right now there, there's like a very low moon, so I don't have too much lighting, but okay, I can't touch those. Uh, let's go over here. So this right here, this stone, right? I have um, one of the best, best sets of tools in the game. So where it's still up in the air, whether ebony is better or whether uh, lava is better, whatever the wiki decides, that's what I'll go with. But I like the way ebony looks, so I'm keeping with the ebony stuff. Plus, ebony is more expensive, so it would entail that um, ebony is better, but at the same time, gold is more expensive, and it's not better than iron tools. So, and then what we do is we switch over to these, and I'm just going to grab these, just like that. I don't know. Can you guys see very well? You probably can't see all that well. Let's, uh, let's switch this up. I'll put those filters back on so we can do some night grinding. Uh, and I don't have my my chamber stick with me. Where is it? There we go. Filters. Right click filters. Whoa. I'll turn it down just a little bit. Just a little. There we go. We don't we don't want it to be like crazy. Like that. Oh, wait. Can the gamma come down? The brightness go up? Oh gosh, that's no, that's horrible. Gamma contrast. Ooh. It's a little bit better. Let's turn that brightness back. Oh, that didn't work so well. Oh my gosh. Is everything supposed to be blue like that? Ah, uh, you know what? We'll we'll leave it for now. And I'll uh <clears throat> Yeah, I'll just play like that. That kinda works. Anyhow, press ease. And if you'll notice, I'm I'm not waiting for this to get finished. I'm actually going over the top of it and just switching. Just smack E and keep going. Oh, come on, come on, choppy chop chop time. And that one was actually, oop, oop. If it turns red, wait for it and, come on, click. There we go. And this is the grind, this is what I do. I need some monies, so this is what I'm doing. Why am I doing this? Well, it's really fast for me to, um, to pick up the, uh, the slate because of the tools that I have. So what I do is I run the slate as fast as I can over to uh, Chamel, Camel, Chamel. Now I think this was the last bit of rock on this island so I may have to do a mid run and run it all the way back. Why does it keep making me ragdoll? I don't, I don't know. Why does it keep making me ragdoll? Uh, by the way, if you're actually going for the elements inside here, like uh, if you're going for the tin or the iron or the gold, whatever, slice it like bread from, from the very tip and make sure that it falls down. But if you're just going for the slate, like I'm, I'm not really worried about the... Uh, is that too small? No. I'm not really worried about picking up the iron or the metals themselves. I don't know if that's iron. You can't tell with the uh, with the filter on. Oh, and another thing, the um, the Robux cards. I do apologize. That's not going to get you a full thousand. It won't get you a pass into the game, but it will help you on your way. So you're not having to spend a bunch of money. Bunch of Robux. There we go. Let's put that into... Can that one... Yeah, that can be changed. So we can just do this, this, this. Whoop, right in the middle. <clears throat> oh, hi, Code. Mm. Hi. Finally, I'm here. You're here. Did you did you come over to my island? Welcome to my house. Play that music too loud. We don't have to go out. <clears throat> So I uh, got to meet some of my uh, daughter's friend's parents today. It was a pretty in-depth conversation. We had pretty, we had some fun, and you know, just hanging out and, and chatting. But um, 
it's one of those moments where they're wanting to do slumber parties and hang out and do other stuff, and I'm like, well, I'll, I really want to meet the parents first. Uh, and my wife was supposed to go, but she's feeling under the weather right now. Uh, by the way, my wife is having her final surgery on Wednesday. It's not big. It's not a. It's not a crazy surgery. It's the uh, the um, last surgery before the big surgery. So. Um, and, you know, that is a scary thing to anticipate. Any kind of surgery it is still really scary. And it's okay to be afraid. So, if you're looking to go and have surgery or anything, just know it's it's okay. There's a lot of professionals and there's a, a lot of people who go through surgeries every single day. And they're having the same emotions as you. Um, the only thing I can do is I can just I can make it where I can relate to it. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I look evil. Alright, let's turn the contrast down. Let's turn the brightness down a little bit. Can we turn the gamma? I'm trying to get just the right balance of brightness and gamma on there. So it doesn't look too... There we go. That might be a little bit better for us. All right, let's hit tab back out. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's good. So now you can see, but it's still really dark on my screen. So that's good. That's good, good, good. Okay. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and drop these. If somebody else wants to grab these, they can, but they have to wait until my ownership goes off of it. Which I'll just leave it here. Um, whose land is this, anyway? Nobody's property. Ooh. If you are... Where are we at? That's north. South. So, if you are east of, um, Big Booty Island, I would suggest coming over and getting your... Oh, oh. What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this? What's this thing over here? <clears throat> oh, that belongs to Calamon. Calamon. Code, can I ask? Stop. Sorry. I'm wrecking. Ooh. Okay, that is that is not a nice sun sunbeam. Hold on. Let's go back over to our filters and turn that off so you can see this pretty sunrise. There we go. This game, man. Just listen. It's got ambiance. I like it. I like it a lot. Now, did something just move over here? Did I see that out of the corner of my eye? Who is chopping down trees and just leaving them all over the place, huh? Who is this? What you doing? I don't see ownership on any of this. You need to pick up your stuff. Ooh, more rocks. First things first. Oh, can't hit that. Okay, so let's uh, grab this one. I do apologize. My nose is still messing with me. Anyhow, what was I saying? <clears throat> oh, got to meet the parents. And... Uh, had fun. I even went and got some blizzards for all of us. That was good. I like blizzards. I'm probably at work right now, by the way. Mm, okay. Code, can I ask? Sorry, I'm recording. Where to buy good stuff? I forgot where. I am going to tell you. Go check the wiki page the wiki page winky face <laughs> it's not me uh have i given you guys the, the link to the wiki wiki page yet it's proju-testing.fandom.com proju-testing is it testing two? Hold on. 
Projute. Projute. There we go. Here. Um, do -do 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 -do. And I'm going to give them... Boom. Right there. Projute dash testing dot fandom dot com. Projute dash testing dot fandom dot com. Head over there. If you're looking for NPCs, good stuff to buy, you can hit Sandra. She does the... Oh, that's not a place to buy. Uh, you can hit Harold. Nope. Where are the blueprints? Hold up. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Go back. Where the blueprints go? Oh, tools. Tools, tools, tools. Chisel, saw, metal. Metal axe. <laughs> Most visited places, you know? There you go. Okay. No, these are the prices. Copper tins. Where's the blueprints? Where are the blueprints? Okay, anyhow. Let's jump out. Go back, go back, 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 back. The, let's see, all the blueprints are in the stone stuff and, wait, are, they're not all in the stone shop, are on Booty Island with the stone shop and blueprint shop. Boot E. <clears throat> to get hat, scarf, uh, foil pants, and foil foil shirt, you will need about three. No, okay, about seventeen hundred. Seventeen hundred kip for the foil suit and was it like 600 600 for the winter gear hat and scarf I think it's 600 I can't remember how much it was hold on let's check something let's go to a different place that I shall not announce That's okay. I don't have it either. Oh, we do have it. I'll make sure the wiki gets it up there, though. Cool. Um, back to the game. Back to the game, back to the game. Oh gosh, sorry. I was supposed to be grinding this entire time and just talking to you and having fun. But apparently, I just got distracted. <clears throat> um, real quick. If you have in the past purchased uh, private servers for anything and you don't play those games anymore, you might go get rid of the private servers because they are taking your Robux every month to keep them up and running for themselves. Um, this, for example, I still had uh, Unboxing Simulator. I haven't played Unboxing Simulator in almost three months, I think. Like, I don't even remember the last time that I played Unboxing Simulator. And it was like 500 Robux per month. What? Oh, no, no, no. Not Unboxing Simulator. Uh, it was the other one. The Jailbreak thing. Uh, it's not Jailbreak. It's something else. Uh, 
Oh, that one's full. So whenever you become full on your backpack, switch out the backpack that you have in your hand, and voila. Because you don't you never you don't really need more than two tools out at any given time to switch back and forth in between. And if you do have something else, all you have to do is come up here, hit Q, drop down the backpack, and that's very dangerous because like I could kick it out and it's scary. Anyhow, grab that back up. I hear something burning in here. Hello? What's the torches? Whose is it? Nazu Reborn. Dude. Very nice house. I like it. Very quaint. Mm -hmm. If I have time on this video, I will go show you what I've been working on, by the way. I have some stuff to show you. And I will make that my next video, which is measurements and how to measure out um, burn times and stuff like that. Oh gosh. This way you could go and verify yourself uh, on the different stuff. Come on, come on, come on. Just pick it up, dude. Pick it up. Pick it up. Go. Okay. <clears throat> Last little run, little check. Little checky poo. Make sure we're not missing any rocks here. All those rocks are on all those rocks are on that guy's property. I can't pick them up because I'm not whitelisted. Please don't sail without your boat. <clears throat> Just so you know, they do float. What's this? Dude, iron bars for free. All these iron bars are just for me. Hello. Oh, come here, come here, come here, come here, give me, give me, give me, give me. And give me, give me, give me, give me. Oof, oof, oof. What were they? Were they tin? Look like tin. Does anyone else feel like this? Wait. <clears throat> Does anyone else feel this game is less physical and interactive than Lumberjack Into? I really miss that feeling. Um, no. It's a lot more. <laughs> you just need to get up in levels. Tools. By the way, I don't think this hat was fitted for my character. I just, you know, it, it doesn't look like it covers his head. <laughs> okay, so if I look south, if I direct myself exactly south and Scatland is to the right, that means I am in a east coordinate of some kind. If I look south and Scal uh, Scatland is um, right in the middle, that means I'm somewhere in the center. And if it's to the left, I'm somewhere to the west. So right now, judging where Scatland is in comparison to me, I'm heading west to get back to uh, where I need to be. Oh, by the way, my son, he saw me playing, and he came up and hit Q on my chisel, and I chucked it, and it was in the middle of the dark, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I was so angry with him. Like, I don't usually get mad or angry or upset by games, but dropping a chisel or dropping a pickaxe is like the most infuriating thing on this game. If, especially if you didn't mean to and you drop it and you go to pick it up and you kick it and it goes off into the water. Oh my gosh. So, to my son, I apologize. I didn't mean to like yell at you like, no! I do apologize. But don't throw my chisels. <laughs> I need a shirt that says that. <laughs> don't throw my chisel! Just... <laughs> Uh, okay, so I only have uh, like five minutes left, and this isn't going to be a full pack, but I, I will go. I, 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 I will go show you how much I get from like just a full thing of slate, and you can grind it pretty fast if you've got these tools. Just saying. And does it feel like the day cycle is nothing? Like we started this episode with the sun behind us, and it's now thirty minutes in, and it already feels like like we're gonna miss the. the Day cycle. Ugh. <clears throat> There's somebody sailing over there. Look at that. 
I'm sailing away. And if you sing the next part to that song, I need you to comment about it right now. <laughs> I really, I really like having boats in this game, though. <laughs> Devaldio, we need boats! <clears throat> it's just that in the chess and the backpacks, it takes away the fun of Lumbertech and 2's unique system of just throwing your items on a truck. That is true. That is true. Of course, you did have your inventory where you could pick up the axes. And Defaultio, he said that in one of his his uh, panels at um, RDC. He explained that the ability to pick things up and they were just in your inventory didn't appeal to him for that particular genre or that game. So he said, what if you didn't have that ability? And in the end, he couldn't get around it with the axes. He had to put the axes in the inventory because you, you pick them up and use them as tools. But everything else, that's what he did. We're just slowly moving in here, aren't we? Dismissed. Dismissed my reminders. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Get over there. Okay. Yay, big jump. So let's go ahead and switch out our backpack. We'll switch out to all these. This is going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 stacks. So... A stack is um, six or eight of something, depending on what you have. Switch out the chisel. Hi. Hello. What's up, super pig? So I'm going to get 900 kip from selling all of these. Cha-ching. Hi, code. Hi, super pig. Thank you. So now I hit tab again and just check. Yeah, we're good. Switch out the backpacks. Come on, come on. Hi. Now I'm going to switch this. Because I got this for free. Sell these iron ingots. Three of them for 96. Sure, why not? Thank you. And then I'll go ahead and sell off the stone. Oh, oh. Oh, come on. Stop talking to me. There we go. Come on. One. There we go. Sell off the stone. Ten of them for 100 kip. Nice. And that's it. Um, if you want to make money really fast and you've got the big tools to do it, make sure you just you run some slate. It usually takes about 15-20 minutes to fill up two backpacks worth, as long as you're constantly grinding. One thing that I've noticed is hanging out in the game seems to be more of a social thing than going and grinding the game. Because a lot of people, they like talking and hanging out and just being interactive with each other. Especially when you like throwing slate at each other. Because you can, you can take the stones, you can chuck them, and you can hit people in the heads. It's fun, it's funny. But it's not going to progress you any further in the game if you're doing that. So, just so you know, progression is grinding. Go and grind. So... <sighs> Uh, yeah, that's about it. I mean, love you guys very much. Thank you for watching this episode of ProJute with me, Heath Askins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos, but it's up to you. So with property, do I want to take a spot? I'll answer them in just a second. Um, love you guys very much. Have a great night, and we will talk to you very soon. <sighs> outro. 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 Thank you.